What's up guys, this is Sape Knight, and welcome back to Final Fantasy II for the NES. Finished doing all that crap in Finn with fighting Scott and getting the ring, and now Hilda's sending me off to some place called Salmando to look for some mithril or something. But before I do any of that, I went and got a bunch of tasty stats off screen. Got their weapons a couple levels higher. Got their HP and MP up a lot. I really needed it to get that high. Maybe not the MP, but I ended up just getting it that way anyway through the HP. I got their spells up a few levels, and then I just went and just started um, self-casting like the attack spells and shit on me to drop my HP and doing that. By the time I got the critical, I burned through like 40, 50 MP, so that helps out with the HP and MP boost. This bastard right here gets freaking like 50 magic power or 50 MP every freaking level. So I don't think I even need anywhere near that much MP for like the whole game. I think the last time I played this, which was no time recently, any time recently, what the hell? And uh, I think everyone had like maybe 2,000, 2,500 hit points and like maybe 500 magic points, something around there. I know it actually wasn't anywhere near that. But before I get started with the whole Mithril thing, uh, if you remember I said last time, those enemies right there, the captains, actually drop really nice gear. Some gold armors and a flame bow, which is a really nice weapon for Maria. Like an insanely powerful weapon, I think it's like the third strongest bow in the game. So I'm gonna try to see if I can get some of those to drop, because I really want those. Because I want them. God Try that again. Like rebels, and then you the automatic battle. Okay, so you can still hit me in the back with a bow, but I was hoping you would actually like hit either Furion or Guy. Let's see if we can try to get changed to work. Cause they have around 700, 750 hit points. I guess men having 400 something, I guess that's kind of... Kind of wish men would have had like some offense spells. There's already like 400 some damage right there. I didn't even see if it did anything or not. Fuck it. Well, I remember peeping. I think it's called peep or it's called sight. And four does like a like it lets you look at the enemies like HP, MP, and weakness or something like that. God, you hurt me! Fucking die! No money, you suck. Did it drop anything? I guess it did. Gold armor. Alrighty, so that's one of the things I wanted. Really wanted the flame bone, but... Go ahead and give that to him, since they seem to hit him more often. Defense goes from 4 to 17, so that's like 4 times the freaking defense. That's awesome. Try to get 3 more of those. I really want her flame bow, and I think if they drop a spell... I don't remember what spell, so I'll see you when I see you. Okay, that's one of the spells. I thought it was... Okay, I, got... I don't know why I thought it might have been like a different spell. Alright. Okay, so he does get a second spell. Do, 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 be, do, do. That's like an extra one. I end up like... Giving one to... Um, what's his face? There we go, that's what I really wanted. Nope, 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 nope. 
flame bow. Give to Maria. Attack goes from 10 to 51, so it's a plus 40 attack power, so it's like times 4. What I was doing before. Ah, I still need 3 more freaking armors. Okay, that took so fucking long to do, Jesus Christ. So I got everyone with the gold armor. Got her with the flame bow. Also went, like, um, equipping them with some potions. Because you can use items in battle, but you can only use what you're equipped with. And you don't actually use from your, like, shared inventory, which is fucking stupid. He doesn't have anything, though, but that's fine. Um... I gave him, I gave Firion and Guy, Curse, and Toad, and got those, like, a couple levels. And then I end up setting off, like, the, um, the extra ones. I picked up, like, a few more spell scrolls. Those things sell for, like, several thousand apiece. I think, like, 4,000? 5,000? Somewhere around there? Ugh, <sighs> now I'm back over here, and I'm actually going to- fuck. Got to move. Get back to the front row. And a side note for your experience and whatnot. You, um... Uh, the experience you gain for your spells and your weapons are based on the monster you're fighting. Like, clearly, if you're fighting, like, a shit monster, you won't be able to get to level 16 with your sword. Because the enemies around Altia and Gatia stop giving me XP at around 5 or 6. But, um... And the same thing about, like, some of the spells. But the captains, on the other hand, those are actually, like, a few tiers above those. So I still do get XP for those. So I'll be able to get his shield to, like, 8, almost 8.5. And Her bow to 7.5. And, and then his shield to 8. How about I ride the pipe? Yes. I do need to go there, but I want to look around town first. Palm and Pop to still get attacked, okay? From here you can take a ship to Poft. That's actually where I have to go. Yo, how about it, babe? Sleaze. <laughs> really? Hey, Poft Bof... Bofska. God, it's a weird name. Salmando will be taken by the Empire soon. What do we have here? Dagger, Mace, Axe, Bow. Mace is technically the second tier weapon, but I want to see something with that one. Okay, so the Mace is technically stronger. We got a broadsword. Getting another mace, see if that's stronger than the axe. Since they're the same level. Nope. Palm is a free town. I hope we remain that way. Ugh. Me too. Ooh, bronze. But, you know, an extra point here, an extra point there. Oh, whoops. It does add up after a while.
Oh yeah, wait, what? I took off her bow? No. Okay, there's just an extra one that I had. But I sold off all the stuff. But <coughs> oh, excuse me. Okay, what do we have here? Your blink safe shell. Get those. Oh, baby. Okay. I'll see you in a few minutes so I can just get these like a couple of levels before I actually move on to the next area. Ah, oh, Jesus, fuck, man. Okay, so. Okay, save the four, shell the five, blink the five. I'm not really concerned about getting safe higher than that because I don't really need the physical defense because I have like higher defense from the gold armor. Ah, hell. That's where I've done more grinding than actual progression. Got the puffs, I'm analyzed north, buff to the east, okay. Yo, how about a ride? Nope. Bosk to the east is occupied by the Empire, something terrible is being built there, okay. Carrots, okay, same thing. Everyone say the same thing in here? I guess it looks like it. Hey, you want to ride my famous airship? I can take you anywhere. No. Pay the man beside me to ride on the airship. Okay, not just yet. Well, I guess I can do it now. Want to ride the world's only airship? We can take you to faraway places. In a flash, but it'll cost you. Money's not really an issue. And Salmando, that's actually where I need to get to. It's probably in the town's pub. For some cash, he may give you a ride on the airship. Or his airship. Does it probably have like, the same stuff as Palm? Oh, no, copper. I don't remember that being there before. Or it might have been, I just didn't notice or something. Bosk to the Ezok. Okay, that's the same thing too. Goddamn. I just say, please don't no new spells for right now. Oops. Okay. Okay. Ah. You See, and it's actually right there. I could have technically have just walked there, and I think Bosk is. That one that's like on the east side of where I just came from, but I didn't feel like walking because I'm lazy. All men from Salmando were forced to mine Mithril at the cave behind the Samite waterfall. Okay, okay. Mithril was mined from the Samite cave southwest of here. Mace long, battle long. Oh, long sword. Battle Axe. Should be better than what I have right now. Ah, shit. Oh, yeah. I think he already has a mace. No, no, crap, no, he doesn't. He has a fucking shitty cane. If I ever need money, I can always just go back to, you know, Finn and just farm stuff from the captains. Okay, so you get a- okay, so there's a copper and bronze. Okay. Everyone should actually be uh, outfitted with bronze, except for, like, the, obviously the gold armor. Magic, yeah. Kind 
God damn it, okay. Life, okay. I guess it would have helped if I actually talked about some of those spells that I just picked up for what's your face. Safe increases physical defense, shell increases magical defense, and blank uh, increases evade. Life will bring a person back to life. The higher the levels, the more life gets brought back with them. Anti, I think, removes MP. I don't think it actually drains it. Like, it doesn't, like, take it from them to give it to you. It just, they just don't have it anymore. I want to say six called it Rasp. Or something like that. Warp will actually warp you back a floor. But I think... I think it can be used in combat to do stuff, I don't remember, and that actually warps you out of a dungeon. But at the cost of, like, some hit points. But I think the higher the level, the less hit points it takes. Okay, so give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. God damn it. <sighs> Fuck. It's been doing all that grinding for these other spells. Shit. <sighs> God, fuck me in the ass. See why I didn't like playing this game before. Pain in the fucking ass, and I have a feeling this never would have actually caught on in the U.S. And to be honest, I don't think this was actually one of their more popular ones, mainly because of that concept of the whole having to grind for stats and shit like that. And don't get me wrong, it's in, it's a very interesting gameplay mechanic, but it gets really old really fast, and it gets to the point where I'm I'm getting aggravated having to do it, and I'm not even, like, I'm, like, maybe a sixth of the way through the game. I'm, like, not even at my first dungeon yet. Uh, so, warp used in battle actually acts as death, like, instantly killing an enemy. The higher the level increases the chance of it working. That's the only reason why I even got it up to that. And then life um, brings you back with more hit points. Ouch. And then for exit, it's actually less hit points that are used. Oh, um, whatever you cast it. Uh, I'm gonna make my way to that Semite Falls, which is actually over here, the little blinky dot that's like right here in the lower left corner of that box. A G goblin? I guess a green goblin. But at the same time, the whole grinding for all these stats. It, um. You say it's time to do it in the long run. Nice Maria. Soldier? It's like a level one of the, uh, like the, those kind of enemies. They have soldier, sergeant, captain, and I think, like, death rider or something? Oh, that's garbage. Yeah, I'm really surprised I don't get a poison spell. I swear I did. It must be three that I'm thinking about. Save it. Save my first real dungeon. I got like a thing for later. Nothing new yet. For 
fucking goblins and green goblins. Spell. Or especially when I get heals to level up, like, God damn it! Okay, these are new. Yeti and Sprinter. Can I still take them out with this? Uh, because uh, the way the heal works in here is uh, level one will cure poison, level two will cure poison and blind, three poison blind paralyze. Then poison blind, paralyzed, silence, or something, and I think it goes all the way up to eight. To like cure everything. So if I can heal to level eight, I don't need to keep anything like eye drops or freaking like echo screens, mate and kiss. And that gold needle and shit like that. Ah oh, shit. God damn it. Ah, fuck. Really? Fucking douche nozzle. Slam. Ambushed. And they fled. Okay. I think those are like physical attack. Um, like strong. Like they have a high defense, but like a low magic defense. Or something. One gift, really? somewhere deeper in the cave, but I couldn't find it. I'll help the slaves escape. That's cool. I wonder where the hell he ran off to. Yeah, I got... Okay. 
Okay, so that's... They look boss-ish. I guess I could have taken care of that and then just, you know, came over here and then did whatever. God, Jesus, fuck, man. So many battles. Exit, but suddenly monsters. Okay. Land turtle. That mythos mine. Mine? Oops, Sergeant. This hopefully shouldn't be too bad. Hell out of here. The okay, warping you magic warping will magically warping will magically take you above ground, however it will also cause loss of HP. See even at level what? Five. It still took off like almost seven hundred. Jesus fuck man. Back to Salamand, Salamand, whatever. We do. Ah, oh, God damn it. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and call it here. I'm really fucking exhausted after having to do all that grinding and shit for spells. When I come back, uh, I got the mithril now. I can actually go ahead and make my way back to Finn. Start making mithril gear. And then... Uh, I have to go somewhere? I think I actually need to come back this way, I want to say... Possibly? I don't remember. They have to come back towards this direction-ish. And, um... I'll just go from there, because I don't remember exactly. So I'll figure it out next time. So, until then, this is Save Night on Let's Play Final Fantasy 2. Later, guys. <laughs>